In today's video, I'm going to be talking to you about when the ratings refresh is going to happen on FIFA 18. So the Lunar New Year event does end on the 19th, which is a Monday, so we are quite surprised in this. I did actually think it was going to be later on, maybe in a week's time, maybe on Friday, which would be pretty interesting, but I guess they don't want the promo to last that long, as we can see the information here. So it started off on the 16th, which is a Friday, and it will end on the 19th, which is a Monday. So I was thinking that the winter ratings refresh would happen on the Friday but when the Lunar New Year did event I did also think that was Friday so it would kind of collide and EA don't usually do that but now that the Lunar New Year event is going to be finishing on Monday it could be a sign that they do the ratings refresh on a Monday not a Friday in my opinion they most likely will do it on a Friday because they're not going to start a new promo or a new event right after one has just finished on the Monday I think they will wait a few days just so people can kind of rebuild if they did sell some players in their team earn a few more coins do some SBCs just kind of catch up with FIFA a bit because of all of the chaos from the Lunar New Year event like the flash SBCs and stuff like that and for champions obviously that would be during the weekend they can just rebuild and get their club back to normal also if they did do an event just right after another one it would be quite odd they don't really usually do this because they want to save some time they want people to rebuild and everything but also after the ratings refresh if they don't have anything else to release then it'll be two to three weeks without anything happening on FIFA which wouldn't be interesting interesting at all for any of the community. Which is why I'm pretty certain that the ratings refresh, the upgrades and downgrades are all going to happen on this Friday upcoming and in my opinion it will be pretty cool. I did do some past videos on it but there will be a few SBCs and stuff like this. It will also be a decent investment opportunity for gold rare cards, just the lowest rated ones. You can get some for around 76 or 75 rated ones. Those will be really cheap. You can pick them up for 700 coins. Thank you guys for watching this video. I'll see you tomorrow around the same time with another video.